Hi guys, welcome back to playing tribute to Fire Emblem Awakening. Uh, huh. full disclosure, this particular paralogue takes me so many tries every single time I play it. Every single time I play this game, I mean. Um, and as you may notice, I'm, uh, I'm not on the map. I already tried this level. Four times! Uh, so to spare you the agony of that, I cut that hour, yes, a full hour of no progress. Uh, I cut that hour out. Uh, unfortunately, it also cut out the little opening dialogue. So to catch you up, here's what's happening. Uh, there were some villagers that were trying to um, get into this town because Risen were attacking, and the town would not open its gates to them. And uh, we came by to uh, help to save them and protect them. And that's the main problem here. We need to protect them. Um, and that's what's taking me so long. Because I like to make sure that everybody stays alive in this game. And if a villager dies, I'm not happy. Uh, and I need to restart. So I am throwing caution to the wind as far as my troops, um, because they are less of a priority than the villagers here. But anyway, long story short, this paralogue stinks. <laughs> Let's see if I can get through it. Uh, fifth time's the charm, right? Here's what I've learned so far, and you guys have missed because, again, I cut that agonizing hour out. Um, I learned that I need to rescue as many times as possible and bring them over here. Um, in fact, it's so hard, uh, and I need to fly ahead of them, or ride ahead of them, or whatever, down here. The problem is, the map does not allow for very quick crossing of horses through the trees, or really anyone through the trees, actually. The trees are bad. Uh, it takes a lot of movement away. So... I got a lot of horses, I got a lot of flyers, and I got some faster people and some distance ranged people. Um, let's see what I can manage with her. I wanna just, I wanna zoom out a little bit. What do I have? Okay, I can reach those two with her. What about... Yeah, I'm gonna switch. Whoops, nope, I didn't want to switch her. Okay, well, that's fine. I'm gonna switch those. Over here. Okay, now she can reach all of them, and she can reach all of them. You know, given that she goes to the right place, and given that she goes to the right place. Besides that, I need to make sure to be able to move quickly across the battlefield. Okay, I think... If I kill these guys and rescue these villagers up this way, they will have a harder time getting over here. Unless they go down this bridge. But you know what? We'll learn. We'll learn. We're gonna do some learning today. Alright. Let's do it. I saved it, right? Just making sure. Yeah, unfortunately, the fact that I saved it is the main problem because it won't let me go back to the map. There's the village. Okay. So. I'm gonna pair these two up. I'm gonna attack, and I'm gonna hope that Sumia helps. Yes, she helped. Yes! Okay. This makes things seem possible. That's fantastic. And her glass lance broke, which means I don't have to worry about that uh, breaking later on. Okay. Good. Good. Great. 
Again, not caring about bonding and training as much as just killing these guys and keeping the villagers safe. That is my number one concern right now. So... He will kill him. And that's perfect because... Villagers down there are at risk of him because he's a distance attack, as you can see, he's a javelin. There we go. Now this guy's still at risk by this guy, so... I can't do anything about that, but I can protect him in this way. Um... Now the only problem with all of my troops moving this way is that they're not moving in the direction that the villagers are going to be moving. I don't like that. Okay, what is his range here? control which way I rescue him. So if I rescue him to the right, that's a waste of a spell. Perfect. Lovely. Love to see it. <sighs> Do you know how many times she's leveled up to level 10? Let me just tell you. It's... Yeah, it's oh, but... play juggle the villager. Wonderful. Now she's in danger. But I'm less concerned about that than I am about the villager, sadly enough. Uh, she's outside of the danger of that armor guy. So, Stall, if you could be so kind as to attack this guy. We might manage this. Despite all odds, don't kill her. That's the only thing. She's she needs to be alive to rescue people. Okay. Okay. Fantastic. Lovely. Oh, I set my flyers over this way. That's no good. Alright, who's he in danger by? Not by him. Yes, by him. And yes, by him. So. I can hope that Sumi attacks again. The problem is, I think that the Pegasus Knights are fast. 
Which means that they'll kill them because they'll kill them in two shots. Damn nuisance. I'm very sad that I don't get to bond people together. But you know what? Leveling is still happening. So, you know, training is happening. Okay. They're no longer helpful. Yeah, they run, and I just warp them right back to where they were. That's how this battle goes. And this is why I hate it. Okay, uh, stall. Where can I... Mm -hmm. I can talk to the villagers. It won't do it me any good, but I can. Okay, Elwind will destroy him, so that's good. I'm gonna put him here, though, so I'm closer to the action. Doing this? Oh, good. Gaius gets a little bit, too. Way to go, guys. No bonding, but, you know. It's what needs to be done. certain the villagers are safe, or when I'll get the village and the sparklies. Okay, Maribel needs to heal her friend. Frederick is going to run along. And Krom is going to run. Okay, good. We've got the Pegasus Knight over here. It brings her away from. Try to not go As further because I am a flyer. Okay, who are we in danger of now? We've got this guy, we've got this guy. So this villager is in danger. So... Good. At the very least. Fine, she needs training anyway. So now I'm out of danger from... Okay. okay. See, I don't think hey. anything comes of this. Are you alright? <sighs> oh, thank goodness you've come. Are you here to help yes. us? We'll hold them off, run. <laughs> 
See, that's the problem. You're telling them to run. I'm gonna move her here. Hold on now. I'm gonna move her here. So then that way if I need to rescue next round, I can. What? Let's take care of this guy. I trust you, Rickon, to go off on your own here. <clears throat> I might have just doomed myself. But you know, maybe Gaius can protect him. Yeah, I think that that uh, berserker or barbarian or whatever the thing's called is going to come at me. Yep. I'm sorry, Rickon. That's on me. I only have myself to blame for that one. You know, I think in, uh... I think it's later Fire Emblem games that you can actually go backwards and, like, undo a decision. It's very... it's very nifty. I wish I could do that. Because I knew the moment that I did that, that it wasn't a good idea. Shh. Stop it. Stop running into danger. Okay, you're gonna stand there. You're gonna stand there. Right. It's okay, we're gonna do fine. We're gonna do just fine, okay. We're not gonna do fine. We're doomed. Oh wait. 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 Okay, here's the deal. They're dead if one Pegasus Knight hits them. Defend them? No, I did not. Shoot. I wish I could have seen in advance what that would have done. I think I just lost again. I think I just lost again. Let's find out. There it is. <gasps> he missed! He missed! He missed! He missed. The other one's not gonna miss, though. He can come from the side, I think, right? Hmm. Wait. He might yet live. This paralogue, guys, is so ridiculously hard. Yes! Oh my goodness! That might make it. That might have made our run. Finally. Until they're stupid and run off again. Oh my gosh, I swear these villagers are so dumb. Okay. Wait, where's that? Okay, we've got this guy. Oh, okay, they're not in danger from uh, him directly. That's fine. I'm gonna put her... I'm gonna put her first, because... Cordelia 
is the one that can actually attack, so you might as well do that in tandem here. Clear the way for them. Wonderful. So we know they're gonna run straight towards the enemy, because that's what they do. Oh, but we might actually make it. Um, oh, we can't. Oh, here we go, okay. I was like, we can't reach her! Because <laughs> the mountain and the villagers are in the way. Okay, the villagers are safe. Imagine that. Shepherds are always welcome here. Please take this with you. So, uh, in my one of my last playthroughs, I had Krom go over there, and Krom was asking, like, oh, how come you didn't help these people that were sh uh, calling for shelter from the Risen? And they're like, oh, we can't risk our people in our place or whatever. Um... Us out. And with that, she can only rescue. Which is fine, that's most of the uh, stuff I need done. You can do this. You alright? Yep, that'll do. It will indeed. We've actually managed it, you guys. Rest in peace, Rickon. He didn't- he was not a necessary death for this to be successful. That was just my stupidity. But... That's why I don't play on permadeath. Because I can't care about that and also the allies... ...running around. Like chickens with their heads cut off. Oops. I'm gonna wait outside it, though, because... Gaius is low on health. We get some sparkles. Gallop, and we're gonna fly. Oh, I thought I could move her a little faster, but apparently not. Yep, you guys go on to safety. <clears throat> You guys can run as much as you want now. I will die. Wonderful. Okay. You know what? If you rescue... No, you really should save your rescues. That's a good spell. Could be 
All right. Who should make the fi finishing blow? Well, he won't. Get it together. But I might as well bond since I didn't get a chance to before. <laughs> so they're bonding. It's great. They can bond. This can heal him. It's gonna be great. Ah, oh, it's been a rough one, guys. I'm just so relieved. So relieved. They can bond. Beautiful. And Krom can maybe finish him off. He can hit. Yes. All right. Ah. See, I didn't even have to tell you that I tried this for an hour already. I could have just made myself look good and been like, yeah, first try! <laughs> totally, first, first try. Yeah, they were the heroes flying ahead. Thank you. It's not the words to thank you, nor the treasure to pay you, but here, take this. I didn't think people like you still existed. I'll never forget this. <sighs> just suppose the village will continue to bar its gates to refugees. Right. As long as they feel the risen is something someone else's problem, then yes. Ah. They claim to love peace, yet the uneasy peace found behind a barricade is nothing I'd want. Peace begins with when the fighting is over and the barricades come down. I pray they can see the truth of that before it's too, too late. <sighs> well, guys. Thanks for watching. I mean... I don't really have to say thanks for s sticking around, because, uh, again, the hour was cut. But, uh, thanks for watching! Um, next time it looks like we're gonna be in another little interlude. Hey, look, we did get support conversations after all. An interlude for support and for battle next time. Talk to you guys then.